I'm just going to do a quick a little uh, talk here. Last night I did the video where I showed you the uh, Alien Isolation Pipe Bomb that I textured with Smudger Pro, which is a sort of a cheap alternative for substance paint. It costs like 30 bucks US, um, and it works right in, in Blender. So you don't even have to leave Blender. You don't have to UV unwrap unless you want to. This is the subway scene that I worked on a while ago. I left it, the subway scene, yeah. I left it untextured. What I think I'm going to try to do, subway scene. I'm going to try texturing it with um, Smudger Pro. Um, the thing is, uh, you, if you really want a lot of those surface imperfections like dents and, and, and rust and stuff, you you either want to use um, techniques in Blender or in Substance Painter and use them in combination with Smudger Pro. I'm going to try modeling or uh, texturing, sorry, just a few objects just with Smudger Pro, just so we see how it goes. And later on, we'll look at um, integrating that maybe with some of the procedural uh, materials uh, in Blender, maybe even some actual textures in Blender as well. Okay, so that's... Uh, that's all I really wanted to tell you for the time being. Uh, I'll probably try and start that tonight. I'm thinking about the desk fan there. I don't know if you can see that. Uh, they pointed at it properly. All right, so stay tuned for that, and thanks for watching.